Hey, what's going on, good people? It's your boy, Pastor Mike, pastor of the Total Grace Church, located right here in Lexington, Kentucky. Also the creator and founder of Not Your Ordinary Vegan. Listen, man, I drove all the way out here to church to set up in my little office studio to record this video, get all the way to the door and realize I forgot my keys. So we gonna have to roll here in the car in the parking lot. Listen, I'm a chocolate brother, man, hoping the lighting is right, but I got some great things for you. This again is our Sunday night night, Monday morning time of devotion, also to push you and motivate you for Monday morning so we can have our Meatless Monday. Hey, yeah, you heard me right, man. Meatless Monday. For all my friends, family, fans, followers on social media, all of you looking to try this new vegan lifestyle, but maybe, uh, let's see, can I put it this way? Bacon still means more to you than your health. If bacon still means more to you than your health, then if you're still struggling with the idea of becoming a vegan, then one day a week, one day a week, you can give up meat. Join us for our Meatless Monday, man. I believe you can do it. I'm rooting for you. Listen, we're going to have a devotional. We're going to pray tonight, and we're going to encourage you to do this Meatless Monday with us. It is a great way to incorporate the vegan diet into your week. We'll start with baby steps. Meatless Monday. All right, who's down with me? Listen, if you're down with me, I want you to put uh, in the comment section of this video, I want you to write, I'm down, Pastor. Write, I'm down, Pastor, if you're going to join us, and I'm going to check in with you. All right, well, hey, let's get down to business. We're going to do our devotional, uh, and then we're going to encourage you a little bit again to join us on our journey uh, for Meatless Monday. All right, hold on. Here we go. Listen, when I was a child, man, I often had a struggle with fear. I mean, I was talented, I had a lot of skills, even as a young age, but I had this, this fear that stopped me from doing things. I probably could have accomplished a lot more at a young age if I wasn't afraid of what people may say about me, afraid of failing. So many things that had me paralyzed in fear. But I had a father, man, who would always sit me down, and my dad would tell me, son, there's no need to be afraid because you can do anything. You can do anything because it's not about your skill, it's not about your ability, but you have a power on the inside of you. And this power on the inside of you will allow you to accomplish anything. Man, I'm so grateful for my dad because he taught me a life lesson. And now that I'm older, this makes me think of Philippians 4.13. In this verse, it tells us that we can do all things through Christ who gives us strength. It is through Christ that we have the power to be more than conquerors. We can do anything through him. So here's your devotional thought. If I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength, then what am I waiting on? What is preventing me from tackling my dreams, from accomplishing and acquiring and walking in my destiny? It shouldn't be anything because you can do all things. Remember that. Hey, what's up, y'all? Seriously, for real, for real, you can do all things. All things include making healthy decisions about what you put in your mouth. Listen, we're concentrating on what goes in your mind, what goes in your spirit, and what goes into your body through your mouth and what you eat. So again, man, I encourage you to join us tomorrow for Meatless Monday. Everybody who watches this video, I want you to do me a favor. If we motivate you, man, if we encourage you to have a healthier and a better lifestyle, go to the YouTube page and click subscribe. It is highly important that you subscribe to the channel. We will continue to update you on different meal plans, different workouts, and then devotionals to help you get through your week. Man, I love you. I hope you know that. I'm praying for you. Uh, as a matter of fact, before we get off tonight, uh, I just want to pray before we do. God, we thank you right now for just everything you've done in our lives. God, we thank you for your word that says that we can do all things because you are the one who gives us strength. Give us strength to determine the why the why we want to change our lives because of our children we want to live for because of the goals we have in life whatever our why is God focus us in on that why so that through your power we can do those all things even choose a healthy lifestyle so that we can have the strength and the energy to glorify you God we love you we thank you it's in Jesus name we pray in Jesus name I pray Amen. All right. God bless you guys. Remember, not your ordinary vegan. Hey, there's nothing ordinary about you. God created you to be extraordinary. Peace.